Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Tanks Foods and Drinks. Today I will be making you a chili dog pizza. So, let's get it started. Okay guys, first we're gonna put on you know put the crust in the tray and we gotta put some olive oil on it. It's a huge ass bottle of olive oil. So quickly little quick little ooh, yeah, that'll work. <laughs> put the olive oil away. And just spread the oil around the crust, you know. Spread around the crust. We'll get it all nice and brown when we cook it, you know. It's gonna taste great too. Got to get around the top part as well. You know, it's just the way people like it, you know. Okay, good. Now, we're going to move this out of the way for a little bit. Set you over here. Got some hot dogs here. We're just gonna cut up quick. Then I'm gonna cut them up and put them in a bowl. Cutting up, we're gonna put them in a, this bowl right here. Just gonna slide them out. These ones are a little frozen, but I'll get through them with the knife. Okay. I'm using Oscar Mayer hot dogs because they were cheaper. You know it'd be awesome if these were cheddar dogs. Uh, but pickers can't be choosers, you know. Then, you know, repeat the process of just cutting the dogs up. Why did I do this earlier? Eh, uh, wasn't thinking. Alright, we got all the dogs cut. I'm gonna take these out. Quickly we'll grab the rag. Wipe down that area a little bit. Clean area is a good area. Okay, now we're bringing in the crust again. Now, we've got chili with no beans. Two cans of it. 
it. Uh, well, maybe one can will be enough. Well, we're gonna we're gonna find out here. Oh, shiza! Little mess, little mess. Grab the rag again. Hey, shit happens, especially when you're wearing a white shirt. Damn it, tank. Oh well. Okay. Now we just pour it on. Well, we're gonna have to use a scooper here. We have one of these handy dandies. Just plop her out. just making a regular thing of chili and I was just getting the beans out and shit and it sliced the shit out of my finger oh so guys I highly recommend to be very very careful with these chili things okay now we're just gonna kind of just spread it around <laughs> oh oh this one had beans sorry Whatever, we'll still eat it. Come on, just spread it around like that, you know. People would guess that you thought, "Oh, tank! I don't think I've ever had beans on a pizza." Well, this is no ordinary pizza, my friends. This is chili dog pizza. Now, I'm just going to plop, set some of these hot dog slices in here. Some of them are a little big, you know, that upright, you know, down like that, you know. Whatever you choose, guys. We're going to mix it up a little bit like that. Some of these are a little big yet. Cut them up. <laughs> I have a funny feeling my dad's gonna love this, but it's gonna sh make him fart like crazy. Dad drop. <laughs> you know, just lay the dogs out, you know, just get it out of there. I think I cut up too many dogs. I guess one thing would have been okay, but. Hey, what do you know? It happens. You know, you can nuke the little things up and, you know, dip them in ketchup and shit like that. You know, just do what you gotta do with them. Now, we got that pretty much covered. A couple more spots right here. Then, you know, etc. You gotta cover the thing with cheese. Oh wait, I might get all these on here. Cool. I doubted myself a little bit there, guys. That's rare for Tank to doubt. Alrighty. That should be enough right there. Now, got some cheese that are kind of defrosting right now. But, just give me a minute, this might... Just loosen up some cheese. We got some four cheddar blend Mexican cheese here that I'm going to put on. And also, give me a minute. Ow. <laughs> oh, this, okay. You know what? The four, four mix might work a little bit better because it seems to be loosened up more. So, well, prior to this, we should turn slightly to the oven. And we're going to put the thing to bake and set it to 350. You know, a lot of things are set at 350. 
let that preheat for a while. Okay, good. Now, now that this cheese seems a little more loosened up, yeah, give me slightly difficult te technical difficulties here, but we're gonna start putting the cheese on top of the dogs in the chili. Oh, you know that a little more. We'll just break some of those up. In the okay, we're just gonna go like this. Yeah, I wasn't didn't think this through, guys. It was they were in the freezer. Okay. Gonna add more. Just. Get Oh yeah, guys, and we're going to be just about done here, but we're going to still have the oven preheat for a little bit longer. Okay, yeah, it should melt over a few of these things, so, yeah, so that's pretty much what we need there. And if you want, I guess you could put some more dogs on top of the cheese, but we're not going to do that. Well, you know, we'll put a little bit, you know, just a couple of them, just like, like here and there. We're actually going to go like this, you know, right there, and right there, something right there, and then we're just going to go like, Smiley. Got a smiley face there now. Eat these two little dogs that are left. The oven is still preheating, guys, but this video is a little longer than I expected. But oh well. Alright, the oven is now preheated to 350 degrees. And we're gonna just stick this bad motherfucker inside the oven. Uh, probably. We're probably gonna have it for, uh. About. We'll check it in an hour, okay? So. So see you then, guys. All right, guys. I just got it out of the oven. It's uh looks pretty good, you know. But let's take a little pluck off of here for a little bit and give us these dogs a taste. Mmm. Mmm. We're gonna we're gonna have it cool down for a little bit before I cut it, but. That's pretty much it, guys. It's uh, that's how you make a chili dog pizza if you're hungry. But I, I probably recommend with chili with no beans in it, and let's try to slice the dogs a little bit smaller than I did. But unless you want to be perfect, just like me, and just do what you gotta do. So, so right now. Oh, wrong drawer. 
let's give it a little cut. Okay, let's move this side here. Good. This is plenty warm, guys, so be careful. Hmm. Cheese is moving a little bit, but that's okay. Ah, got it in half, so that way. So now we're going to just go from... Come on. And now we're going to rotate again. Well, guys, you know how to cut a pizza. Come on. This is one of the many ways to cut a pizza. <clears throat> oh, come on. Again, like I mentioned when I made the bacon wrap chili dogs, you really need some elevation for this, guys. So, one more side to cut. <clears throat> okay. That is awesome. We got their slices cut. And. Now we just grab a plate and a spatula. And plop. Now look at that guys. Look at that thing. Now you can you know just some of the dogs will fall off, but that'll happen. So See how this tastes. Yeah. Some dogs did fall, but that'll happen. down in the description so I do highly recommend this pizza so just try it if you want tank approves and guess what all lives matter signing off peace